At around 10 a.m. today, the body of the late Hajj Aziz Kasuja arrived at Chiwuli Mosque for the requiem prayers. Government officials, politicians, religious leaders, friends and family attended the prayers at the mosque. Sheikh Shazim Muhammad from Kansanga led the day's preaching. Hajj Kasuja suffered a heart attack last evening while attending a meeting at Broadway School in Kawempe and was pronounced dead upon admission at Platinum Hospital in Wandegea. In the present speech delivered by Hajj Musa Chigongo, the NRM Deputy National Chairman, the late Kasuja, was praised for the patriotic services offered during his time as a government civil servant in different offices. The President contributed 20 million shillings towards the burial arrangements. <laughs> The Lord Mayor for Kampala Areas Lukwago, together with a number of politicians, lauded the lead for the continued support towards the Muslim fraternity, being a courageous and hard-working person, adding that his death is a big blow to the country. Because I've said, as family members, we have had a candidate talk with him, one on one. I've been visiting him at his home in the year. At one time, he even donated to me a Quran right from Kaaba. You can only remember him for that courage, for the principle and the steps that he took to bring uh, hygiene in the electoral process of this country. Other shortcomings not understand. One of those revolutionary youth during the 60s who were organized by uh, His Eminence uh, Sheikh Abdul Bed Kamregia to see that the leadership of Muslims is, is transited from the, 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 royal, the royal families to the sheikhs. The body of the late has been laid to rest this evening at his ancestral home in Mbulile Massacre district. Kasuja left the electoral commission in 2002 after the 2001 elections he oversaw. Earlier, Kasuja had served as a commissioner at the Stephen Akabwai headed interim electoral commission. He was later appointed Uganda's ambassador to Saudi Arabia. May his soul rest in eternal peace. Reports compiled by Juliet Namwea for Urban TV.